Hello avid royal watchers, welcome back to the channel. In today's news, Meghan and Prince Harry continue to build their team of advisors as they transition from their old royal habits to their new lives in Los Angeles. After officially stepping down as senior royals, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex switched their communication team from Buckingham Palace's aides to PR experts at Sunshine Sachs. Now the couple are believed to have tried to recruit Rebecca Mostel, an experienced aide who had worked with the Beckhams. A source told The Sun Rebecca is extremely discreet, diligent and professional and has been around high-end celebrities for decades. She's exactly what Harry and Meghan were looking for and came highly recommended. Miss Moscow joined the Beckhams in 2007 when the football star signed a contract with LA Galaxy. But the Hollywood expert has worked with several more celebrities in the past, including singers Prince and Seal. The source added, Rebecca has her work cut out, but then working with Prince can't have been a walk in the park. Meghan and Harry's post-royal lives began on April 1st. As agreed with the Queen and Buckingham Palace senior aides, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex are no longer to use their full royal titles, need to change their old branding Sussex Royal, and can't carry out royal engagements anymore. However, Meghan and Harry have been allowed to retain their patronages, and as several videos published over the past weeks have shown, the Sussexes have continued to stay in touch with organisations close to their hearts, even by living across the pond. Prince Harry's patronage, Onside Youth Zones, shared a video on YouTube showing the Duke introducing the broadcasting of last year's Onside Awards. In the video, Harry praised the young people around supported by the charity for overcoming challenges on a daily basis. Speaking about the coronavirus pandemic, he acknowledged the issues may have been, become even more pronounced over the past few weeks. He said, I can only imagine the last six weeks have made it even more challenging. This too shall pass and before you know it, you'll be back together again, probably in a youth zone running around having the best of time ever. In late March, Megan took part in a video call with a client of Smartworks, one of the Duchess Duchess's four patronages. During the video, Megan congratulated with a young job seeker for how well prepared she appeared to be for her upcoming interview and wished her luck. Meghan and Harry also chose to celebrate their son Archie's first birthday by sharing a video to cast a light on Save the Stories, a new coronavirus appeal launched by Save the Children UK. In the video filmed by the Duke, Meghan reads Duck, Rabbit to little Archie, who delighted turns pages in and interacts with his mother. The caption to the video explains the Sussexes joined the campaign to help those children in the UK and across the world whose livelihoods have been hardly hit by the coronavirus pandemic. The caption to the video explains the Sussexes joined the campaign to help children in the UK and across the world whose livelihoods had been badly hit by the coronavirus pandemic to provide them with learning materials. That is all for today's news. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next video.